Moment in Christ, our everyday encounter with the Word of God, today we are going to share a very strong prayer for protection. Subscribe to the channel and leave your like, share this video with 7 more friends, to help the channel reach more people, activate the notification bell. For you to be remembered every time new videos come out here on the channel. Powerful Prayer Psalm 91 with Saint George, Holy Warrior, let's start with the word of the Holy Father. Words of the Holy Father The tomb is the place where those who enter, do not leave. But Jesus came out for us, rose for us, to bring life where there was death, to start a new story at the point where a stone was placed on top. He who rolled away the stone from the entrance to the tomb can remove the rocks that close the heart. For this reason, let us not give in to resignation, let us not place a stone on hope. We can and should wait, because God is faithful. He didn't leave us alone, he came to each of our situations, in suffering, in anguish, in death. His light illuminated the darkness of the tomb, today he wants to reach the darkest corners of life. My sister, my brother, even though you have buried hope in your heart, do not give up. God is bigger. Darkness and death do not have the last word. Courage. With God, nothing is lost. This prayer can be done in the form of a novena. Light a candle before starting the St. George prayer with Psalm 91, and when you finish, blow out the candle. Concentrate, stay calm and say the prayer quietly and with faith. Sao Jorge will not abandon you. O oh my St. George, my holy warrior and protector, invincible in faith in God, who sacrificed himself for him, bring hope to your face and open my paths. With his battleship, his sword and his shield, which represent faith, hope and charity. I will walk dressed, so that my enemies, having feet do not reach me, having hands do not catch me, having eyes do not see me and not even thoughts can have, to do me harm. Firearms will not reach my body, knives and spears will break without reaching my body. Ropes and chains will break without my body touching. O oh, glorious noble knight of the Red Cross, you who with your spear in hand defeated the evil dragon, also defeat all the problems and my enemies that I am going through for now. O oh, glorious Saint George, in the name of God and of our Lord Jesus Christ, extend to me your shield and your powerful weapons, defending me with your strength and greatness from my carnal and spiritual enemies. O oh, glorious Saint George, help me to overcome all discouragement and to reach the grace that I ask of you now. Place your order with great faith and clarity. O oh, glorious Saint George, in this very difficult moment of my life, I beseech you that my request be answered and that with your sword, your strength and your power of defense I can cut all the evil that is in my heart. Path O oh, glorious Saint George, give me courage and hope, strengthen my faith, my life spirit and help me in my request. O oh, glorious Saint George, bring peace, love and harmony to my heart, to my home and to everyone around me. O oh, glorious Saint George, by the faith I place in you, guide me, defend me and protect me from all evil. You who live under the protection of the Most High. And you reside in the shadow of the Almighty. Say to the Lord. Thou art my refuge and my fortress, my God, in whom I trust. He will deliver you from the hunter's net and all enemies. And from the pernicious plague. She will cover you with her feathers. And you will find a refuge under his holy mantle. His arm is a shield and breastplate. Thou shalt not fear the terrors of the night. Nor the arrow that flies by day nor the plague that lurks in the dark, nor the plague that rages in full sun. Though a thousand fall at your left and ten thousand at your right, you will not be reached, with just one look. You will see the punishment of the wicked, because you have made the Lord your refuge, and thou hast set up the Most High as thy defense. No harm will come to you. No plague will come to your dwelling. 
because he entrusted you to his holy angels to watch over you in all your ways. They will take you in their hands so that you do not trip over any stone. Thou shalt tread upon lions and snakes. You will step on lion cubs and snakes. I am a servant of the Lord. He gave himself to me, therefore I will deliver him. I will protect him, because he knows my name. He will call on me, and I will answer him. I will be with him in adversity. I will defend and glorify him. I will make you enjoy a long life. And I will make him see my salvation. Amen. Subscribe to the channel and leave your like, share this video with 7 more friends, to help the channel reach more people, activate the notification bell. For you to be remembered every time new videos come out here on the channel.